we are back at it again with the Ashenshen and we got level 1 invade. Now um, we got the Camille matchup again and this time I'm going for Teleport Ignite. Because I was thinking Teleport Ignite is like it's like it's like pretty good, right? And Camille is doing that also. So do we want to? Do we want to? Maybe we don't want to. It's kind of uh It's kind of hard without Rakan. We don't have the damage to kill somebody. So I'll just go top lane for now. And for, as for the build, we will perfect the static shift build. Right here. Oh, wait. Guys, actually. Should we try something else than static shift? Are we tired with static shift? Are we liking static shift? Do we just try a normal build instead today? What are we feeling? Twitch chat is saying static is based. We love it. The longer you think about it, teleport is flash, but a little bit longer. Oh. You're right. <laughs> you're, you're really right. <laughs> well, we'll just have to see what the items bring us today. You know, we don't have to determine anything in advance. We'll always figure it out as we go. She starts W. I got three minions, she got two minions. We have Grasp, she has Grasp also. Got the magic damage done through the shield. I'm not level two fast, she's gonna hit it first though. Ah, oh, my bad. I should not attack that minion. She's gonna W probably. And that's when we look for the E in. But what is this? <laughs> Get him, boys! <laughs> okay, what are we? What are we thinking? We go for our boots and uh, let me get this. And we have the ignat to return to the lane. It's okay, it's okay guys, don't worry about it. Try to level 2 gank me again! It won't go well for you, that's for sure. Did I dodge that? I think I dodged that. I tried man, I tried to get her under tower. I think I got this minion. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh. And this e attack speed. Okay, I got Q here. Boom. And I get the. Ooh. I don't get the. I got the oomph. And I got the. I got the oomph. Okay. Where one C is down. Waves are even. I have one kill. Camille has one kill. It's alright. We can work with this. Jarvan there. Kill the wave slowly. I don't know if Camille is gonna use TP. She's probably not gonna use TP. She should be here already if she did. That's fine by me. I have Ignite in 120. She's got double buffs. We need to wait until the double buffs time out. We don't wanna take a trade because anyways, even if the trade goes well, which it probably won't, she's gonna regen back up with the red buff um, health range regen. So no reason to trade right now. All we should do is just Farming, slow pushing, crash the wave. Look mid lane, try to get level 6. Not yet. I, I want to trade, but I can't. Okay, now we can. Ah. Oh. Not bad on the last hits. Darwin is coming to upside, I think. We just did a little bit of uh, scaring the opponent under tower. Nothing too major. I wanna get some wars down because I'm scared that this Jarvan is gonna come for a repeat gank. I need to get the experience from the melee minion, then I can finish clearing this ward. Get the XP. Wave is gonna slowly turn into a push towards my side now. She lost a lot of minions under tower. Notice W usage there. 
Jarvo might be coming topside. I need to back off. He's obviously not level 6 yet, but... Like, uh, Camilla will be 6 soon, so then Camilla grab his ultimate and just chain me up. We need to be smart today. No funny business. We've done enough funny business for today. All that's left is serious. Serious petu. But maybe if a build will go funny business. Let's see. This is gonna be really bad because we can't ultimate to bot lane, right? Uh, because the wave is gonna be so big. So I'm gonna ping my team to go back. Because if I ulti now, I'm gonna lose the... Uh, lose the lane, to be honest. And I'm gonna be pretty upset if I lose this lane because I... Nice, nice W usage there. And then the shield blocks the um, Camille W. Why do you have to fight? Okay, it's fine. It's okay. Team is doing good. Okay, team is beautiful. Guma Yus is morphing in the bot lane. Forty-three CS to forty-three CS. Pretty even, I would say. Nice, good trade. Two minutes until TP. She still has hers. That was good. By her. With the W usage. Remember, she has mana. I don't have mana. So she can run out of mana. I can't run out of mana. That's one advantage that we have. We still have a refillable potion. Blocked it with W. I use my refillable potion now. I got her on the uh, return when she was running away with one auto attack, that's fine. She's gonna run out of mana eventually, right? Oh, actually, never mind, she's not. She has two biscuits. So, the way I see it, she has infinite mana because of the biscuits. Because they heal um, missing mana. I'm just gonna use this for ultimate, she's gonna have to cancel me. Wait, she doesn't? Uh, well, that's a free kill for me then. I'm not upset about it at all. Let's push the wave out. Uh, Kami is gonna push that. I'm gonna recall here. Kami is gonna start shoving it into me. I don't know, Jarman can stop me with E, yeah. I'm still gonna recall here. Um, so Iceborne would be good. How about some Sanderers today? I don't hate the Sanderer here. They have Jarvan, they have Camille. You can kind of contest the melee 1v1 with this um, item. Although Iceborne is really good, but then again, it's no Divine Sanderer. <laughs> do, 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 do. 10 seconds until TP, can I get this minion? No. Pehmita, pehmita, we soften up those minions. With the cannon, with the sheen proc, extra damage in W for sheen proc to get that minion. Could I have gotten the other one? Maybe with just faster attacks. We will have unleashed TP soon, so we would ideally wait for that before using. It's at 10 minutes, right? It's pretty early. Hmm, Jarwin is here. Okay, I'm coming, I'm coming. They use ultimate. Good one on Dracon. Ah, he still has flash. Got one. I have to do, try to dodge the Syndra Qs. Do I have anything? Nice. Ah, he kind of went in to die. Okay, Sejuan is here. Do we not fight? I have 50 on Ignite. Can I kill the Camille? Probably ideal would be to just recall and TP. This might go poorly. Wait, there's a Nautilus here again? Let's get this guy. <laughs> Some CC. Beautiful. <laughs> what? He cancelled me. Ah, they really got out. No way. That Nautilus ulti was good. He cancelled my E. 
20 seconds ignite. If you use a second Q, we can walk through here. Not in danger of dying. Mm. Dilia would like some wave clear. That's where the static ship would come in handy. Because when you look at this situation, this is kind of like disabled me for such a long time, this wave. But if I have static ship, I can just one shot the wave, but then I have static ship, so I'm stuck with the item stats. Which I don't completely hate, but it's not like the best stats on Shen to have attack speed and AD and crit chance. Uh, if we manage to farm all of these minions, we can get Sunderer. I didn't want to ult there because I'm so low and I, don't, I have a lot of money as well. So ulting would probably be the bad choice. And this allows me to get ability haste. Okay, you Guma. Guma Yusi, let's go! Fight me, I'm right here! Double kill! Triple kill! <laughs> no you don't. No you don't, buddy. Do you know who I am? <laughs> I'm the Shen. <laughs> okay, that was hot. That was good stuff. I'm gonna recall here. <sighs> okay, what are we buying? What are we thinking? Do we still go for the ship? Don't cancel me, don't cancel me. Okay. <laughs> and I was saying that to Draven, not to YouTube. <laughs> Uh, Ionian boots go crazy. I could TP here. I use my E. Let's go. Whatever. Let's go. Let's go. I got the flank. I got the flank. Move, 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 move. Wait, I'm tripping. <laughs> I'm tripping, bro. The Draven went there. <laughs> Oh no, now Camilla's gonna take everything topside. What did I do? What have I done? I need to go catch some waves. I can't stay here forever. Zildra? Hello? Wave for me? Okay, this guy's dead. Never mind. She did Zildra stuff. Hit it. And W to get the Sheen proc, in order to get more damage on the auto attack. Double kill. Dodge it. Dodge it. Rip top tower. Rip top lane for real. <laughs> oh no. Why did I TP bot lane, man? I could have just uh, taken my advantage. Now Camille is gonna be fed because tower platings are more the most OP thing in the entire existence of League of Legends. Um, hello there. Notice, uh, wait for E so that you can interrupt um, her E. Ah! Oh, that was really good by me on the E read. Actually, it's, it's like I, I very often fail to do that. But you have to wait until the Camille E connects onto the wall, and then you can cancel it by taunting her. But yeah, that was good. Uh, then I can look for an ultimate opportunity. I'm gonna go static shift here. I don't really care. Like, I just feel like that's gonna provide me the best wave clear possible. And it's gonna turn me into the Giga Chad that I want to be. So I'm gonna do it. Hello Jarwin. Oh, Syndra might be here actually, I can't. We are, we are playing smart today, we're not being dumb. Because if I try to do stuff with Jarwin under tower, and I waste my E, and then he ults me, and then Syndra stuns me. I have my ultimate for mid lane. I probably want to defend the top lane tower. I think it's gonna... No. Save the tower. Save the tower! Police! I'm 
I'm playing Plants vs Zombies Tower Defense over here. Boop. Thanks for the donation, buddy. I'm looking for ultimate. Shiv 2650. Ah, relive. Wait, I don't have TP yet. I was looking for a TP on the Raven. Let me get the tower. Camilla's just farming. Yeah, I stole it. <laughs> Rakon Ignat was gonna kill that guy. <laughs> classic, classic League of Legends moment. <laughs> oi, oi, oi. Oi. <laughs> I had to do it. Like I thought about it, I'm like, yeah, Rakon Ignat is gonna kill. But then Rakon Ignat is gonna kill. So do I want that? E? Into ulti? Oh, big. Flankerino. Big boy flank. The long range flank over here. <laughs> Where are you going, driver? Where are you going? <laughs> Wait, you missed And I have enough for ship. Insta recall. That's an insta recall right there. Oh. Go back. Let me get this. And now we're really cooking. I'm the kill steal god. <laughs> 30 seconds on ultimate. <laughs> oh my god, this game is so much fun. Uh, two minutes on both Infernal and Dragon. I have to think, I have to think. What are we what do we want? Which one of those do we want? Obviously. No, it's not obvious actually. Like if you're given the opportunity to choose, you probably take Baron. But it's like important to think about this beforehand. So I have ulti if needed. I would need some AP to one shot the backline. Okay, good job, Jinx. Good job, Jinx! Triple kill. She's going for more. Baby Guma. I got you, man. Quadra kill. And the penta kill. Yes. Team. I love you. And she's alive. <laughs> Woo. Let me get the refill ball. Okay. Bomba. Bombastico. We just end the game here. Is he that good, really? They can't. They possibly can't do it. The sub 20 minute end. In the Master Hilo game. Okay, I'm scared for my shutdown. But Jinx is not. Jinx is not scared. Uh oh. I'm a little scared. Zap. Okay. We don't have a minion web, by the way. What are we doing here? <laughs> 14 on 1. Can I tank the tower? Not really. Uh, I kind of want to get some AP. I don't need AP. It's fine. I can uh, kill the minions now, because I'm getting levels. I think static ship uh, damage from level scales faster than... Um, the minions HP scales if you are like uh, properly leveling. I re we really need to recall though. I have 30 seconds on ultimate and this is like all of us have shutdowns and uh, we should we should play this smartly. I'll just recall and then I have ultimate to get back to into the action. Um, some resistances are required. At this moment in time. Aegis of the Legion is perfect. Three seconds, guys. Three seconds. 
Hurry! Another penta! No. Okay, the game is over. GG, well played. What can I say? What can I say, man? That's how you play. That was the counter pick to Camille. Divine Sanderer Shen.